Today on 10 Minute IT Jams, we're talking to James Bailey from Subquery, a company that develops solutions that make decentralized data more accessible to customers. Thanks for coming along, James, and welcome to the jam. Thanks for having me, Mitchell. Fantastic. So um, just to start off, for a business that hasn't worked with Subquery before, what are your key kind of products and offerings? Yeah, sure. So we are a blockchain company, and what we do is basically organize blockchain data into a format that uh, people use it for apps. So the challenge of blockchain data is that it's essentially a linked list. It's a very long series of blocks, a chain of blocks. Uh, and imagine like a book of pages, trying to find all the pages that a certain character appears on. Um, looking up data is quite similar, right? You have to go through every single page sequentially. And after doing all that, you finally know, you know what pages they appeared on. And you can equate that to like getting a list of transactions for your wallet. If you want to get a list of transactions for your account and a bank account, you need to go through every single block in history, which could be hundreds of millions of blocks. So SubQuery is a, a service that's used by a large number of blockchain development teams around the world. And essentially we index data. We point to a blockchain, we allow you to define a certain mapping function. Uh, and you can say that on every transaction, I want to save uh, who sent it, who received it, the amount, the date and time, and subquery automatically uh, looks at that chain, connects to it, and indexes the entire history as well as every new block that's added, right? So it takes all this blockchain again, the most horrible way to query data, the most inefficient medium story for data. Uh, it takes it from there and it puts it into a format that makes it very easy to build uh, applications on, on top of. Oh, fantastic. And with the whole concept of decentralizing um, data in this way, can you kind of describe the benefits of this to a company? Yeah, so uh, look, a lot of um, industries right now are looking to blockchain and they are looking to it, um, you know, really intensely and really, you know, data is the most precious resource. Like we can see the success of all these huge applications like Facebook that have just built the, the empire on data. And we believe it's not gonna be any different on blockchain, it's gonna be the same, uh, same challenges. Uh, so decentralized data in particular, uh, it's all open, it's all public, it's all there in a blockchain. That's the thing about blockchain, it's open. Um, so it just makes that problem more uh, present, right? Rather than these stores of data hidden away and locked in a bank somewhere, everyone around the world has access to it. The challenge though is getting that huge volume of data, those terabytes of, 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 of blocks into a format that you can better use and that's that's really what we solve yeah no that sounds very very um a very good way to do it um so just talking about your recent um partnership congratulations with akala in late uh, 2021 can you tell us a bit about this partnership in general and what's been happening in that space yes that's a great question uh akala is another team uh, partly based out of new zealand like us uh, basically, they're building an ecosystem uh, on a new, Polkadot, a new blockchain called Polkadot. Uh, we're working with them very closely. Um, Subquery at the moment is open source. Anyone can run it. Uh, we provide a managed service for our customers and many of the biggest wallets, uh, NFT marketplaces, uh, block explorers will use our managed service because we look after your project, we run it in a production way, uh, we keep it online. Uh, but what our goal is, is to decentralize uh, our network. And that means that anyone can run a subquery project, can offer that data to the world and can be rewarded for doing so. That's uh, the subquery network in a nutshell. A partnership for Kala means that we're going to be building this decentralized network on their blockchain. Uh, it's a very close partnership. Uh, Akala are doing a, a DeFi hub and I believe they've been on this, this series before. Uh, and uh, we're working very closely with them to build the contracts, build the logic inside their network, and then launching that uh, later this quarter for a test network and hopefully going to a main network uh, by mid this year. Oh, fantastic. I'm looking forward to that. Um, we'll see, see um, seeing the results of that. Um, so with other projects in line for subquery, what's, what's in the pipeline for 2022? It's a lot of hard work, right? Um, we're... Essentially, like blockchain, right? There's a lot of different layer ones. Um, so we've been working really hard with Polkadot and we've built a bit of a name for ourselves in this ecosystem. It's growing fast. There's a lot of developers building on Polkadot. It's actually the second largest developer community behind Ethereum. Uh, but we can't rest. Um, although we're still bringing on partners every every day because they look at us and they say, 
Now, I was talking to an NFT provider this morning, and they said to me, James, you guys saved us two months' worth of engineering effort by using SubQuery. And, you know, luckily, we reached out to them in time. So that's kind of what we do for our customers. We save time and effort. Uh, we've done that at Polkadot. And we're doing that very well with Polkadot, but our next challenge is to extend that to other layer ones. There are many different blockchain networks growing out there, uh, other generation three layer ones like Solana, Cardano, Algorand, Avalanche. One of our big tasks is how do we take our existing uh, code base and also take this value to those, uh, those newer networks? There's a lot of potential out there. Mm, it seems like it. Um, and just to kind of um, summarize and finish off, um, what kind of um, resources and um, places do you have in the uh, Asia Pacific market and how do enterprise new users get in touch with you? So we're uh, majority based in Auckland, New Zealand. We've got members all around the world, but most of us are based here in, in New Zealand. It's great to be in the same office together uh, and talk about these problems together. Uh, but we're constantly hiring. So <laughs> if you're looking forward to getting into blockchain, if you're looking forward to getting into data, you don't even know anything about blockchain as long as you're smart and can learn on the fly. Um, let us know. So the easiest way to get in contact with us is, is subquery.network. Uh, that's our website. On there at the bottom, you'll find links to uh, Twitter, um, our email address. Um, our Discord is our main community. There's 25,000 people in our Discord uh, talking about using subquery, helping each other. Uh, we've got a very uh, inclusive community there. So if you have any questions, Best place to start is that Discord group. Well, fantastic. Well, um, we hope to see more people getting on board with SubQuery and um, the things you guys are doing. Well, thanks so much again for um, talking to me, James, and uh, you're yeah, looking forward to seeing what SubQuery has going in the future. Thank you very much, Mitchell. It was a pleasure.